Alright, so what you want to do to get this fight done as fast as possible is as soon as the elevator breaks, you're going to want to stand on the railing and jump off. Get on the railing. You're going to want to turn around here and jump on the guy on the airship. Uh, throw a Devil's Kiss and Bunky Bronco, this rocket guy, and just melee him off. It just takes too long to kill him otherwise. Uh, you're going to have to kill two of these guys down here uh, before the second ship will spawn. And then you're going to want to get up here. And this part requires a little bit of timing, but if you wait till the ship gets to that that right banner, that red banner over there, then you can go and you can board if you're quick enough. And you do the same thing here. Now, you're going to want to stay on this airship. Um, nothing else should be alive except for maybe that one rocket guy down there, but the third airship should be coming in pretty shortly here. And you're going to want to... You're going to want to stare at it the whole time, because if you don't look at it, the handyman just won't spawn, or it'll just be delayed. So you just keep staring at it, get the aggro on those guys, the handyman will come, kill those guys, and you're going to want to get out of the handyman's line of sight, otherwise he will uh, pay attention to you. Right now he's just kind of roaming, looking for other guys to kill. There's a fourth airship coming, and you're going to want to get their attention by just jumping up and down from that position right there. And if you're looking straight at it, you'll probably grab onto that rail, and, and there goes the handyman. He just uh, kind of bounces off the side of the ship and falls down, and those should be the last guys you have to kill. I would have done this part quicker, but I didn't have any ammo, so hopefully you have more ammo when you're doing this. But the, uh, I don't know, it just, it just takes some practice to get this down, and it's not always a sure thing that the handyman's going to kill himself, but it's a lot faster than killing him, and if he doesn't kill himself, he'll go on that ship and wreck those guys, and he should be the only one alive. And that should be the last guy there, and the fight's already done. Right, I guess it takes a while to get you out of combat, though.